Hi friends, it is Aicha from RPA from Bangalore. Now we are continuing like introduction to UiPath RPA. In the last video we have seen about uh, various panels in uh, UiPath. Now we are going to see like you know, keyboard shortcuts. And the first one is the Control plus D means it ignores the actuary that is currently selected by placing it into a command out container. So Control plus D. So once you press the like, control D, you can see our, uh, like, like, here like command out. So comment out container. The next one is control plus E. So it removes the activity from the comment out container it was placed in. The next one is control plus T will place the activity inside the try section of a try catch activity. And the next one is uh, control shift plus N will create like a new blank project. click on create so here you can see the name of the project and the next control plus o enables us to open in the previously created workflow only for dot x aml files will support the next one is f1 like it's obviously it's uh, for like a helpline press f1 so we'll connect it to like a uipath website then control plus l opens the folder where the log files are stored so here's like a log folder The next one is shift plus F9. So we'll remove all breakpoints in the currently open workflow. And the next one is control plus yes will save the currently open workflow. And control plus shift plus yes will save all the workflows that are currently open. F5 runs the workflow that is currently open. F7 runs the currently open workflow in debug mode. F8 checks the currently open workflow for validation errors. F9 marks the selected activity with a breakpoint. F10 for like a debugging skips the execution of a block of activities in the currently work selected workflow. F11 is for debugging enables us to step into a block of activities and executes the first one and will pass or means like a space bar, will, uh, you know, will pass the execution of the current workflow in bo both in normal and debug mode. F12 is for like a stops execution of the current workflow in both normal and debug mode. A control plus C will copies the selected activity or activity set to the clipboard. And the next one is like Alt plus Control plus W opens the web recording toolbar. And similar to that, similar to that, Alt plus Control plus B opens like on basic recording toolbar. Alt plus Control plus C opens the Citrix recording toolbar. Alt plus Control plus D opens the desktop recording toolbar. Okay, we'll see about Alt plus Control plus W. So it's open. Okay, we have recording. 
the next one is R plus control plus B. So we'll open like a basic record recording toolbar. The next one is R plus control plus C. It opens like a Citrix recording toolbar. And the next one is all plus control plus D opens a desktop recording toolbar. And next one, all plus control plus F will set a focus on a search box in the activities panel. So here you can select a search. Next control plus P like it opens a manage work package window. Here you can select a manage packages and please stay with us uh, for more video, uh, for more videos on uh, UI path. Thank you for watching.